288 Forest Road in the basin. This very spot here where I'm standing on this decking is where Nick, his wife and his beautiful little two-year-old daughter Grace, they feed the birds every single day at the same time. That's right, the very same birds come back here every day and this is what they will miss most about this property. Just take a look at the surrounds and you will know what I am talking about. But hey, there's plenty of bidders here today about to realise that dream for themselves. I would like to wish you all the best of luck to the lucky buyer. Congratulations in advance. Now as the lucky buyer, you will be required to sign an unconditional contract today, pay a 10% deposit and settle in a period between 30 and 60 days. Today's auction will be conducted in accordance with the rules and any additional conditions made available for inspection before the start of today's auction. The vendors have a reserved price. I will indicate bidders on request. The auction rules prohibit an auctioneer from accepting any bids or offers for the property once the property has been knocked down to the highest successful bidder. But make no mistakes, buyers. I will give you ample time. I'll call it once, twice, third and final time. But once the contract hits my hand, unfortunately, by that point on, it's back to realestate.com for you. So put the hand up. Go hard, push yourselves, otherwise, as the market keeps going up, you will find yourself bidding on a property more than you paid today, but for one, you don't even like as much as this one. The auction rules, prohibiting auctioneer, I've actually set that rule again, I've just realized that I'm repeating it. Scrap that. The auction law prohibits false bids, prohibits major disruptions by bidders, and prohibits bidders from disrupting others from bidding, and provides fines for this conduct. The rules permit vendor bids and the word I will use during the course of today's auction to indicate I am placing a bid on behalf of the vendors are simply vendor bid and only I as the auctioneer can exercise a vendor bid. Now what are you buying here today? A contemporary three bedroom, one bathroom home. One where you can simply move in just as the current owners did when they bought the property 15 years ago. Since then they've been married They've raised a beautiful daughter and now they're ready to move on onto a bigger property. They want to pass the property onto a family who will do the exact same thing. A family that will enjoy a property that's on just a little over a quarter of an acre in the basin. A flat landscape block ready for you to move in and check out that orange tree there. Surely that's got to bring good luck. The owner told me they have so many oranges, in fact, they have to give them away to their friends at work. That's exactly what you'll get to do. You'll be sharing it with your family. This is the home where you'll get to have many barbecues as you settle before Christmas, beers, all of that, while your friends who envy you, but they won't tell you they envy you about owning this home, can park all along that driveway. Now all of that, and to add the cherry on top of the cake, interest rates today below 3%. I simply couldn't think of a better time to be buying real estate in Melbourne. So buyers, it's over to you now. Start me off anywhere you like. 600. At 600, I welcome you in, sir. I love the strategy. Coming in with a $600 opener, $600,000 opener. I welcome you in and I'm searching for rises with them. At six, what was that, sorry? 650 at 650 welcome to you guys a strong knockout bid from the beginning with a fifty thousand dollar ride 660 welcome back 670 guys all the other bidders haven't forgotten about you 70 welcome back at 670 80 80 680 playing for keeps we're on the market we're selling how much sorry at 700 at 700,000 take a look at that bang that's 700,000 710, jump back. Surely, surely you weren't just a two bid wonder. Come back with me, 710, you know the value's there. At 700, there are no better bids. I will sell the property once at 700, twice at 700,000. Renee, can I confirm we're on the market selling? We're definitely on the market. We're definitely selling, Peter. If there are no. Pardon? Sir? We're on the market, we're selling. I'll take anything from this point. 705 with you and welcome to you at 705. 10. 
10, welcome back. 15, sir. Giving the same courtesy to everyone else. Come back. Now is your chance to do it. 15, 10, 15. Yes? 15, 7, 1, 5, 20. Come back, guys. 20, you've been there from the start. At 7, 1, 5 to my right. 7, 1, 5. Come back. 20, 720. Welcome back to you at 720. 720. Sir, they're going up in fives now. I need you to come back. To double your previous increment. Come back at 730. You won't regret it. Yep, 730. 730. Welcome back at 730. 735. Guys, come back. 730. Once. At 730,000 twice. Third and final call at 730. Of course I'll give you a second, but I'll just remind you of something. Guys, this is the sticky end of things. Muhammad Ali says it best when he says he only starts counting when it hurts. This is when it's hurting. This is when your bits count. Come back. 735. 31. Welcome back. 31. 731. Guys, have I seen your best? At 731. At 731, here for 288 Forest Road, the Basin. Once at 731. What? 740. 740. Yep, I love the style there. Knock out pigs. Yep, that's how you pick, that's how you buy. At 740. Once at 740. Michael, 741, you can come back. 740. At 740 with you guys. At 740,000. Once at 740. Twice at 740,000. Third. And final call at 740. Are you guys definitely out? You've started the auction off. You've come a long, long way. 740,000. Back to realestate.com. Looking for more properties. You know it's there. Come back. 750. Guys, bear with me. I will give you the same time when you need to jump back in. But in fact, I would suggest a much better strategy than taking too long to come back. What I would recommend is you use this opportunity, this time, to think about what your next bid will be, because you know they're coming back, because you know they know what this property has to offer, just like you do. At 740 with you, Michael, 750, jump back. Once at 740, twice at 740, third and final call, 740. We are selling, selling. You guys are definitely out. Definitely out. I need you to say it out loud. I need you to make a statement. Let all the bidders know you're out. I will put you on the spot. It's going to be a lot easier for you to tell Michael what your next bid will be than to stand up in front of the crowd and tell him you're out. You're not a quitter. I know it. I can see it in your eyes. Come back with me at 740. Guys. I'll take a five hundred dollar rise. Seven hundred and forty thousand five hundred. Let me just tell you something. Forget the books. Forget the paperwork. Your last bid was seven thirty one. To jump back at seven forty one, it's ten thousand dollars above your previous bid. Ten thousand dollars with three percent interest repayments. That's three hundred bucks a year in interest. You divide that by fifty two weeks per year, that's less than six bucks a week in interest repayments. What can you buy with six bucks? You can't even get a sandwich from 7-Eleven and half the time they're moldy. Ditch the sandwiches, come back, 7.41. You know it's there. Once at 7.41. Twice, definitely out. Senior best. Third and final call. Mr. Mafia there, what are you thinking about your next bid? What's with the shades, mate? Poker face? Come back, you know you want to. Or jump in. No? Definitely out. Seeing your best as well. Very well. Guys, it looks like we will be congratulating you. You will be popping open the champagne and the salt sticker will go up. Once at 740. Once at 740. Third and final call. Selling. Selling. Sold. Congratulations. Thank you all for Myself and the team members will be sure to contact you about another property, so stay tuned, we will get your phone, and we will send you some, so you 